put glue, wood glue on the end before screw two balls together. flip over and do the other side since I only have one screw in I think this is going the board's gonna move so after I screw all of them together I'm going to put it kind of flat on the ground and then step on it and make sure it's not it's not like at an angle and then the glue dry After you tighten the screw, you want know, to wipe. Make sure all the screws are wiped clean.
And then they flat on the floor. You want to step all the four corners. Because we only have one screw, so the ball might get twisted when you tighten the screw. Just lay it on the floor and let it dry. I fill the holes with the exterior cork. So here's my plan that I put together. I bought the clear panel from Home Depot and it needs to it needs two sheets. So I got two sheets. And I got this closure strip and I didn't realize it until I bought it um, because the size that I initially set up it was based on foot, so I have like two foot um, on one dimension and then four foot on the other dimension. And when I bought the panels, I realized it's not wide enough to install the closure strip. So I ended up cutting a template for the ridge. And I have a bunch of styrofoams um, that I got from the, the online orders. So I just cut the styrofoam and then insert into um, all the ridges. So if you want to use the closure strip, you want to reduce your size at least two inches on each, um, dim on each dimension. So you have enough room to inst to install the closure strips. Those I think those are about an inch, an inch and a half, which I do not have room for it. Um, but it works out. I think it's okay. I mean, ideally, I would like to use those strips. It will look much better. But since I didn't really think it through before I um, put the frames together and that's my solution for it. I screw two pieces of scrap wood and then make it an angle so when it rains the water will be dripping down instead of sitting on the top of the the panel. I did not use screws to attach it. To put it together, I just drill some small holes and then use the wire, like the tiny wires to attach it together. Since I'm going to take it apart in the spring, so it's easier. Um, and it seems it holds up really well. So when the spring comes, I just remove the wires from the hole and then break it down to five different panels and store in the garage. 